we've been doing MMA now, I've been training for five years and I had my first professional fight two and a half years ago. I said to my dad, I said, I don't want to play football anymore because I was playing football at the time. I said, I want to fight MMA and I want to fight in the UFC. And he said, all right, it's going to take a lot of hard work. And from then, we just, we've always trained together. And my dad has been my coach since the beginning. I 19 fights now and every time I fought, he's been in my corner. At the beginning, there were, you know, pros and cons of having dad as a coach. We used to butt heads a lot, but we found a way to separate the dad from the coach. So when it's training time, you know, it's the coach, and then when training's finished, you know, it's back to the dad. So I think we've found a way to make it work. It's definitely a lot more personal having my father as my head coach. I can talk about anything with my dad. You know, he wants the best for me, so he's always going to give me the best training, the best advice. There's no one else really that you're going to feel more comfortable with than your dad. And when you're comfortable, I believe you fight the best and you train the best. My dad's voice, it's very loud, and he, without even trying to be loud, you can just hear his voice, it just projects. That's the only voice I can hear. The crowd's just completely silent. I can just hear my dad's voice. And that was a big thing in the Ultimate Fighter as well. I knew the coaches were giving me advice, but I couldn't really pinpoint one specific voice because everyone's yelling. It's just a completely different environment, but I think the main thing that threw me off was, was not having Dad in the corner. It's just having that, the voice that you're used to, you know what they sound like, and you can, you can pick them out in the crowd. So to be 20 years old and be in the UFC, you've got those doubters. But to me, age is no factor. When you're confident in your training, you're confident in your fight. Fighting in Australia is one thing, fighting in Australia in front of a home crowd in the UFC is a completely different level. When I was doing MMA all I wanted to do was be in the UFC, there were a lot of doubters but you now I made it now.